measurement related word problems today we will learn how to use measurement for everyday task oh wow mango grandpa can i eat one yes you can eat it but will you help me first yes grandpa we have to send all these mangoes to our friends and relatives so first put the mangoes in these boxes how many boxes do we need grandpa try to add and find out the total number of mangoes first okay let me do it 15 and 17 gives 32 32 and 22 gives 54 54 plus 18 gives 72. So we have a total of 72 mangoes. Very good. Now we will keep the mangoes in these boxes. Grandpa, how many mangoes can be placed in a box? The boxes can have a dozen of mangoes. That means a box will contain 12 mangoes. Then How many boxes will contain 72 mangoes? Mm, let me show you. On dividing 72 by 12, we will get mm, 6 means 6 boxes. Oh ho. What happened grandpa? We have to send mangoes to 10 places and only 6 boxes are made according to 12. Grandpa, don't we have small boxes? Yes, we have. It's a great idea, Goody. If 10 boxes were to be made, then how many mangoes will be there in each box? For this we will divide 72 by 10. You can pause the video and try to calculate the answer and then verify your answer with the answer shown in the video. The result is 7. Hmm, some mangoes are still left. Yes, grandpa, two mangoes are still left. Well, this is so good. 7 mangoes will comfortably fit into 10 boxes. And these two remaining mangoes? And this is for you. Thank you, grandpa. So before eating the mangoes, tell me one thing. We have to place these 10 boxes in the car's dicky. Height of each box is 15 cm and height of dicky is 1 m. So how many boxes can be stacked on the top of each other? Grandpa, what is meter and centimeter? These are measuring units. See, this is 1 cm. Oh my god this is so small and this is 1 meter and this one is so huge grandpa yes 1 meter means 100 cm so height of dicky is 1 meter that is 100 cm now tell me how many boxes can be stacked on top of each other for this we have to divide 100 by 15 You can pause the video and try to calculate the answer and then verify your answer with the answer shown in the video. We are left with 6 and 10. So 6 boxes can be stacked on the top of each other. It's good. We have to keep 10 boxes. So 5 boxes can be stacked one upon each other. on one side and the rest five boxes can be stacked on the other side and still we will be left with a lot of space 5 and 5 and we are done with 10 boxes so what did we learn today how to use measurement for everyday task measurement is dependent on many factors we saw how to solve questions based on measuring units of length such as meter and centimeter thank you